Welcome to Workflow 2, Reviewing a Patient Summary. In this workflow, we will review how to open a new encounter and enter vitals, review and update medication, review test results, and review previous chart notes. Opening a new encounter and entering vitals. So you click on patient and the name's up here, then you click new encounters. Then from here, you can enter the patient's vitals and chronic problems. So the first tab is the problems. You can click a little icon here, then enter the new problem. So for example, you can, if you remember the code, you can do that or you can search the wording. This will come up and you can mark down the date when this was diagnosed. So you can put down today's date or different day and click Okay, so that's how you enter the problems. And to enter the allergy reaction, you click the tag right next to it. And same thing, you click on the tab here. You can search by the words or you can enter the code if you know that. So this will come up with the um, options that this person's allergic to gloves. And you can also do the same date. It's nice to enter the date in here. And it's gonna ask the nature. You can pick anything from this list here. And you can see that's been added. And press okay. Enter, so for the height and weight, you go here and this is automatically already populated. If I want to enter the height today, I like to click this date and time and you know exactly then what happened that day. Um, same thing, you just click here and the blood pressure is like 140 over 78, 65, just making random numbers and the person temperature they've been taking today, say 87, um, pulse, say 65, seven, and you hit apply at the bottom. And it's automatically going to the encounter there. Review and update patient medication. To review the patient's uh, prescription, I'm going to click select the patient to make sure their name's up here. Then I will go into the new encounter. And I select on script. And just to double check which medication the patient currently on. So there are, these are the dates when was the prescription was prescribed last time. And then these one here, the discontinued one, they also have dates on there. Um, if I want to give them the current medication they are on, you can double click. It will add into to the ordering RX here. That's the current one. And also I can click on the prescription, right click and edit to make a change to the current um, script was prescribed. You can also see them on your encounter. They are also on the right-hand side here. Reviewing patient test results, including labs and imaging. So to access patient lab results or any results, you click on patient's name, then you can go into patient's medical records. On the left-hand side tab in the blue, you can see this listed and you click on the results. And also it's been has a date in the year and the name of the test results. So for example, this is a lab result. So you can go through here and to check the x-ray, you will see that tab there. Review previous chart notes. 
to bring up a, a patient's information, do you just click select on their name so I can select this different patient here, then go into the medical records. And then you can click on the previous encounter and you can see them on the left hand side. So there's the date, whatever the doctor, previous doctor had recorded. And you, if you want to read it through the notes, you can click individual or you can bring this up here. Um, it will give you the details if you just click on the left hand side so you can see the date um, the other previous doctor had entered. This now concludes workflow two. Thanks for watching.